Now, well, I'm the sister. Will I be able to get that a key has to nothing to do with that. Release, release the scene, you mean? <laughs> That's gonna make the super cut. I gotta go with that once. Because when he left the body here, turn it out of He took my keys to all my vehicles. Relieving moment of this is I've been posting three days on this lady's door since I started working. <laughs> yeah. Like the first week I started here, I posted a three day here. Because it's been a long time coming for you, man. Yeah. I can hear the demons call when they do what they do. And now I feel like taking off, find a place with a view. The pain is never gonna stop. That's some like outdoor furniture, like a table and chairs. That says free stuff. And then the other one that's on the window is the one that says at U-Haul, have any problems, and they like left a phone number. I didn't try calling them or anything. When you are investing in low-income rental properties in the most affordable cash flow markets in the USA, evictions are an unavoidable part of the business. When you hire a property manager, sure, they do their best to mitigate the frequency of tenants who need to be evicted from your properties. But the fact remains, y'all, evictions are going to happen when you are spending your money on the cheapest housing that America has to offer. If you want to invest in real estate but want no part of the eviction day difficulties that you see here on the screen, you may want to look at an alternative investment strategy. That strategy is being offered by Rent to Retirement. Rent to Retirement specializes in build to rent rental properties in the top growth markets across the USA, from Florida to Texas to Alabama. Rent to Retirement is providing investors with a lower risk investment option that allows them to capitalize on the many benefits of rental property ownership while greatly reducing the investor's exposure to the downsides of renting that you see here on the screen. Case in point, if you have cheap, low-quality housing, you're going to get cheap, low-quality people. That's part of the game. If you want to avoid to the very best of your ability, to the, to the most possible way. If you want to avoid that as much as humanly possible, y'all, rent to retirement is the alternative for you. We're going to show you the aftermath of the fire and what it did to the inside of the home. This is the fire at 88th. That's sad. Came all the way up the hallway here. Oh, in this stinky ass fucking place. Oh! The longest journey. <laughs> no matter how far you go down the wrong path. I hit that truck. The car. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> oh, someone opening the door. Yeah. Hello, hello. Hello. This car back here, what's that? It's my uh, big dad's cousin's car. It's not theirs. No, no, it's not theirs. Cool. Cool, cool. And then the basement. Uh, oh, the basement? Uh, we share the basement. I know, so we need to know what was his, what was theirs, and yours. Can you walk down there with us? Yeah, let me grab my daughter. Sure. Okay. You guys had this happen here before? Not, uh, not at this building, I don't think. What, people dying? Yeah. Oh, what? 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 Uh, what? 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 What?
was almost at my car, I saw the U-Haul drive by, and I'm like, oh. lamps you know just regular regular stuff John told me the house was uh, completely filled so we've been talking to you guys you whoever not me no. we've been talking no. to you guys for like three fucking weeks what I'm trying to tell you is we're not doing that anymore this is literally I don't know you. What's your name? James I'm the owner of Holton Wise this is literally the last time anyone is ever gonna talk to you. Like you don't know me. You don't know him. Dude. What the fuck is so funny? Bro. <laughs> what the fuck is so funny? It's it's just like you Has your girlfriend ever stuck your testicles in the toaster oven? Getting evicted from your house feels a little bit like that. Pay your rent and don't forget to tip your landlord. <laughs> That's gonna make the super cut. <laughs> uh, I'm Tim. Oh no. I'm Tiz Misney, and I make him pay. I'm Misney, Misney. Yeah, I can't. It's just. Oh, oh. oh yeah, you finish that up. I'm gonna work on this side. Wow. Yeah, no, I, I hear what you said, bro, but we can't give you any more time, right? So I got this notice. This is an eviction notice. I don't know if you ever seen one of these before. You you want to take it? This is an eviction. eviction. Yeah. So we need to have the, the full 1100 within the next three days, right? This is me serving you this notice. Hey, man, you can't be showing up here like this, man. I told the guy I'd get him next next Friday. You can't be showing up in my house. I don't know what this dude's doing over here. No, we just do we document everything just in case, you know, shit gets weird, bro. But, hey, like, man. hey, it's all cool, bro. Just, we, we like to document everything. That's what we do. We make sure people know what's going on. But, like, I understand what you're saying. Window, melted smoke detector, handprints on the wall. Garage. This whole place is vacant now, so. I know. So do you think we should maybe put the stuff in the garage out? There's a little bit. You want to go look at it? Oh, it's, there's no basement. Out, out, so. yeah. Basement are the only accessible. So. Uh -huh. have down there. So I think these folks are moving out. That's a problem. <laughs> Oh, uh, this might even be from the last people from the down here. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't know. Because they were. You guys want to do it? They were running like a chop shop out of the. No bathroom. If you need us to haul around here, we did yesterday. We'll do it again. Okay, I told I, I told I told him she had 15 minutes to gather her stuff and get out. Yeah. So if you guys want to swing by again in a couple you want to minutes. Out right now? Uh, let me holler down real quick. Let me see if she's getting out. Tell her the police that were here yesterday are here today. Okay. She wants to go. We got a free ride. Okay. <laughs> we dropped a treat in there and he didn't go for it. No. Hi. Hey. 
That's why we're going to put a lock to the basement that we're not even going to give the tenant a key for. This is what she did to this thing. Alright, so we'll go up there. Stay here. Yeah. Get down, down here. here. Oh. She's here. I don't know. I don't think so. Bailiff department! Anybody home? seem to be Jeez, guy, oh, all right. guy. okay whoa, whoa. dude dude calm okay i why the fuck are you still hey, filming whoa, me whoa don't touch the camera right, look okay Kristen. all right calm down hey whoa hey okay i get it you are mad i understand you are you are angry but like lip I'm, I'm, I don't know, it doesn't seem like it, but I'm actually trying to help you right now, because again... I'm trying to help you! No, I don't want the, the whole eviction thing to transpire, because that is going to suck, especially... This is garbage. Especially for the Throwing kids the we're talking about, but like, if you hit me, like, you can't, <coughs> you can't, you can't hit me, you can't hit the camera dude, okay? Like, I get it, but, same thing, like, I'm going to have to cut this short, we're going to have to roll, but literally, I have to give you this notice, you have three days... I gotta have the full 950. If I don't have it in the three days, I file with the courts, and then a little bit later, the cops and my movers, they're coming. I won't be there that day. You know what? Get the fuck out of there's here. There's nobody that's gonna be able to argue with you, and, and they're just, they're gonna come in. Bye. They're, they're coming in. All right, dude, come on. Seriously, like, that's not fucking doing anything. Can we just fucking resolve this? Dude, what the are you can, still doing can we just you're a woman of uh, you okay bro can we just dude, get the fuck out of here dude can we just fucking resolve this now well i'm his sister will i be able to get that has to nothing to do with that it's up in the corner when we release it Release, release the you. scene, the you mean? You, yes. But they're gonna, you're gonna fix the door, right? Yes. yes yeah, that's what we're. So doing. will I be able to get a key so that I can get back in? And yeah. Well, after the after the coroner's done, okay. then they'll give you. I don't know how long. Mm -hmm. Probably a couple weeks, whatever mm -hmm. you need to get in there and get stuff. Mm -hmm. And then anything you don't want, you can leave, and we can throw out. Okay. I'm just mostly interested in going through Hello? his paperwork. I have no idea if he had a will or yeah. if he had arrangements made, which I doubt. But um, I want to get his information um, off his pill bottles for his doctor and everything. Okay. Evictions are already a pretty stressful situation, so we do not want to add any stress to this situation. We do not want to bother the crew or get in their way. Hello? I'm good, so. I see the stack of keys over here. Is that the house keys you were planning on turning in or something? Or are they yours for something else? Okay. Okay. That'll work. I guess we're mm. probably gonna be here a while waiting. That door has been jeeped. Some of you guys had to fix that damn door every time. The people yeah. that lived there before busted it open too. Yeah, that yeah. door. You guys yeah. have that. Yeah. Quite the experience of fixing doors. Here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, the deadbolt is pretty darn good because. Yeah, the Levi's the specific had, They had there. a hard time getting in. Police have to stay here until the coroner gets there. They just can't walk away. Yeah, hopefully. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. You guys had this happen here before? Not, uh, a, not at this building, I don't think. What, well, people dying? Yeah. Yeah, one yesterday. <laughs> what, somebody died on your property yesterday? Yeah. yeah.
Right across the hall, dude, and I'm all freaked out and shit. Yeah. Doors open either way. Uh, this door here? That one, or you can go through the door. So she's going to walk. You guys, maybe one of you and, and, and one of them should go in that basement with her so she can point some stuff out and they, they forget. Yeah. Yeah. Stephanie! Hey, Steph? Okay. We're going to do a walkthrough of the basement with the upstairs tenant to show what's what. Do you have one of your guys? Or you? Okay. We'll meet you. We'll meet you. Uh, here, we can just go through this way. we got to go to the side door. Oh, you can go through. Oh, okay. Oh, God! <laughs> She's just grabbing her last couple things. She sent them. Alrighty. She's got two minutes. I didn't even see that other girl go in there. Where the hell did she come from? I don't know. I was, I was just telling her. I didn't even see them. Her. Student number one's kind of a peculiar woman. Mm -hmm. If she's giving them right to get in there or whatever call it, that might be a problem. That That's why we're going to put a lock to the basement that we're not even going to give the tenant a key for. I understand what you're saying, but you got to understand something, brother. Like, I'm just trying to work this out with you. This... I get that you're living here, right? But this is not your house, right? This is my house. No, nah, man, I'm gonna be paying, no. man. You guys can't no. be here, man. The, but you understand? I don't know what the shit is. No, you, you understand? This is actually my house, bro, and and you're not actually paying yeah, for it. You can't be coming over so, here. So, so, hey, bro. bro, 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 look, look, look. I'm coming here trying to be cool, bro. I'm trying to be cool with you. I'm trying to be cool. Just this is just me trying to work something out with you. If if we got to come back, it's not going to be me. It's not going to be us, bro. It's going to be the cops. And there's going to be a whole crew of people. And they're going to be removing everything you own, bro. And we, we keep it classy here. You know, our tenants like to, you know, almost burn the unit down. They leave their milk out. Break into my unit one more time. I'm dying for you to send one of your ladies people over here right now. No, no, go, go on, go on, please. Because you can't tell me what the I don't smoke, I'm sorry. Look, you gotta smoke. I don't have one either. You smoke? No, sorry. No, sorry. <laughs> Nothing goes right. I don't know what to tell you. 375 by Wednesday, that is the best that I can do. I under, I can't. It's, my hands are tied. I can't, it's, we can't do that. And you know what? That's all you're ever gonna fucking get is that 375 because nothing in there fucking works. We got the leaky faucet, we got the garbage disposal not working, the toilet's running. The tub's disgusting. Do you clean it? Yes! Then, Almost every day. Then why is it fucking disgusting? I don't fucking know. Like, do you, like is it, like, how do you think it gets gross, bro? Like, I don't... I, I don't know. You said this is your place, huh? I, I don't take baths here. What am I gonna do? You know, and Chris is sick. Did you know that? Did you know that Chris is sick? He's been sick for two weeks. With the flu, he's not eating. He's losing weight. I don't want to talk about your baby daddy. I don't want to talk about who's on the lease, who's not. No, 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 but you don't understand. You don't understand what it's like to have three kids, to be struggling. I'm a hardworking woman. Remember, this person has known that this has been coming for seven months. This person has been stealing from the owner of this property for seven months now. And, uh, you know, today is the day. She's got done talking to the bailiff. Looks like she's gonna be pulling off now. Fridge is melted. Fucking walls are gone. Just everything gone. Wow. Door. And shit. A lot of tenants think they can get away with not paying their rent to the landlord. 
Nah, man, that ain't how it goes in this game. If you don't pay your rent, you're getting evicted. There ain't nothing you can do to stop the eviction. We will get inside of your house and remove you and everything you own by any means necessary. Looks like we got pretty much everything. Oh. Yeah, that was the end of it. This door is all fucked. Freaking uh, a dream mattress, man. Dream mattress. Oh. Beautiful. Beautiful. I think if someone from the city did come here, probably would be condemned. I don't know the total yet. Wow. And when uh, if, when we put a lock on there, we're gonna give you a key. I know. But they, that key can't because, be that key. You see that? I didn't even know they broke the lock. Cause I, I had a key two weeks ago. I need the key now for. Right, but we're yeah. gonna put a lock on there, and we're That's gonna, we're gonna give it to I you. That's when I started getting the butcher knife, <laughs> and uh, took a lot of bugs out, hoping they, cause it'd be dark in the motherfucker. What's killing me is, once I move the car, yeah. I gotta move them at once. Yeah, because when he left us out of here, turn it out of here. He took my keys to all my vehicles. And one and three fits deep. You know, so rat poop or mice poop. All over the place. And uh <coughs> Oh guys. Thanks. I got my flashlight. I did. There's that other lock that used to be right here. I guess there's, oh no, I guess there's two, like, I feel like that lady's living down here for a little while. I helped Mama out upstairs. And uh, I've been cleaning the basement, but it's like, it looks like a mess, but it was all closed on top of this before. So it was even worse. A lot of it is stuff that she had stored down here. There you go. Oh shit, it's open. Yeah. Oh, doesn't smell so good. Shit, there should be steps there. There used to be. They took them with them? Who takes a back porch? You can't have nothing in Cleveland, dude. Promise. The problem is that's about the back of that, they can be honest with you. But do what you do. Do what you do. I'm never wrong. I'm never wrong. You know what's funny? This is what it smelled like when we moved in. <laughs> that's not a joke, I remember showing this oh, thing and being like... This is like one of those ones that's like... When you first start doing this job, you're like, this is never gonna run. And then 50 showings and someone lights, and you're like, holy shit. These are the ones you don't see in the other No, ones. you're good, man. That's why I came in the back, but I wanted to stay out everyone's way. Okay. Mm. 
This is insane. This is insane. People think being a landlord in California is easy. No, not by a long shot. We've got to chase down rent, evict deadbeats, fix what they broke in our properties, and keep the police on speed dial to deal with unruly, violent tenants. Close the windows and... Oh, they didn't want to take it in. Something smells like really bad. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, broke my hand around. That's nice. Oh, here we go. Yeah, there it is. That's what's up. <laughs> Had a quick move. <laughs> Uh, that's a fresh onion right there. Yeah. Yeah, right? He's getting ready. Do you want to go ahead and grab him? Yeah. Oh, I'm getting That's some guy ready for it. Fuck it, John. I'm going to go check out the back side of the house here. We're going to have to board that from the inside and the outside. Yeah, you're going to have to be careful. We're probably going to lock that and then just board the outside. You didn't say that. Cause you know it's a lot. This is my daughter apartment. And I pay his rent every month. She ain't lacking on shit. That one melted off the ceiling and that one exploded. Fucking wild, dude. Alright. That's pretty much it. Fucking gross. Ugh. Okay. You know, it doesn't smell nearly as bad as I assumed it would, by the way. Is this the only door for the place? It's no, there's a too. side one. That's to why it. I'm bringing the stuff out, because we got a block. Right. And we can prop all that shit back against the blocked side of the door, too, so. Stay. He goes, you got a game for this place? I'm like, no. You know, honestly, this is already uh, screwed shut because of the crackheads. So I think we should put a board over on the outside as well. Yeah. Yeah, if you guys can get that. Wanna go around and see? Is there anything? You gotta go this way. There's. Oh, I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because you got to take a picture of it. Just comes down, snaps me off at the knees. How would that make you feel? I'd feel pretty guilty. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Holy mm -hmm. mess. You got it? Mm -hmm. I'll set up outside. Good. Tell me I'm wrong. When you're in the ghetto, Section 8 tenants are the best tenants. Sure, Section 8 tenants act like animals, but they're the only tenants in the ghetto who are going to pay their rent. The only kind of like relieving moment of this is I've been posting three days on this lady's door since I started working. <laughs> yeah. Like the first week I started here I posted a three day here. 
This has been a long time coming for you, man. Yeah. We've been talking to you guys, you, whoever. Not me. No. We've been talking no. to you guys for like three fucking weeks. What I'm trying to tell you is we're not doing that anymore. This is literally... I don't know you. What's your name? James. I'm the owner of Holton Wise. This is literally the last time anyone is ever going to talk to you. Like You don't know me. You don't know him. Dude. What the fuck is so funny? Bro. <laughs> what the fuck is so funny? It's, it's just like you seem to be... Jeez, that dark. Okay, whoa, bro. Whoa, whoa. Dude, dude, calm. Okay, I... Why the fuck are you still hey, filming whoa, me? Whoa, whoa, don't touch the camera. Right, look. Okay, Kristen. All right, calm down. Hey, whoa. Hey. Okay. I get it. You are mad. I understand. You are you are angry, but like... Look, I'm, I'm... I don't know. It doesn't seem like it, but I'm actually trying to help you right now. Because, again... I'm trying to help you. No, I don't want the, the whole eviction thing to transpire. Because that is going to suck. especially this is garbage. Especially for Throw the kids. Away. We're talking about, but like, if you hit me, like... You can't... <coughs> you can't... You can't hit me. You can't hit the camera, dude. Okay? Like, I get it. But... Same thing. Like, I'm going to have to cut this short. We're going to have to roll. But literally... I have to give you this notice. You have three days... I gotta have the full 950. If I don't have it in the three days, I file with the courts, and then a little bit later, the cops and my movers, they're coming. I won't be there that day. You know what? Get the fuck out of here. There's nobody that's gonna be able to argue with you, and, and they're just, they're gonna come in. Bye. They're, they're coming in. All right, dude, come on. Seriously, like, that's not fucking doing anything. Can we just fucking resolve this? Are you could, still doing could we just You're a woman of uh, you. Okay, bro. Could we just dude, get the fuck out of here? Dude, could we just fucking resolve this? It's convenient for you with your schedule and I'll send them there. Over me, I'm gonna hang up the phone. Alright, I'm listening. Being rude as fuck. I have not met Grant, I have spoke to Grant. Joe. And stop threatening to evict us because we have done nothing wrong. Joe. It requires a 24 hour notice, right? So, like, they could do it at any time in 24 hours. hours. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.